how to insert social media icons with links in a resume in Canva. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how we can insert the social media icons with their links into the Canva resume that you have created. It is very easy and very simple. All you need to do is to follow up the tutorial from the beginning till the end and you will be good to go. The first thing that you need to do is to head over canva.com. Then you need to search for the resume that you have created. In my case, I will go ahead and search for any resume that I can find in a template with Canva. So as you can see here, we have some resumes. We have some templates. These are some standards. So right here, I'm going to choose one of these resumes. As you can see here, we have the resume set and ready. We are going to see here the resume. So you can see here the name, the occupation or the uh, job. We have here the photo. We have the, uh, as you can see, the uh, phone number, the email. Here we have the location. And finally, here we have the website. So if you want to add the social media icons, all you need to do is to click on elements. Then you are going to search for each individual on, for example, Facebook. Facebook. Then you are going to see here uh, the Facebook. Let's say uh, this is a Facebook icon. So we are going to make it uh, smaller. And then we are going to make it a little bit smaller to uh, be appearing like this. A little bit, maybe a little bit smaller than that. And here we have it. You're going to delete the website. Put the Facebook like that. So then we are going to set Instagram. Then we are going to see the graphics for it. So you can set whatever uh, here. Uh, You're going to see a lot of uh, resemblance. Maybe you will not see the uh, correct right here icon, but you can get it from Google with a, uh, uh, as you can say, a background free or without a background. I'm only going to put this. So we are going to put it like that. I'm going to make it white. So it will appear here on the site. Here we have uh, the, let's say Twitter maybe, or X, I don't know. We have the X, as you can see, sign. So you can go ahead and put it wherever you want from there. Go ahead and choose the correct or the uh, most wanted one. So I'm going to put this Twitter, so I'm going to make it white, so it will be appearing like that. So go ahead and put it wherever you are going to see a space. And here we have it. So we are going to gain a little bit of space here. Boom, here we have it. So now you can go ahead and put, for example, you can um, set a text, for example, a heading Twitter, for example. Uh, then we are going to put it here paint it white or change the color of it. So you are going to put it like this. Then you are going to uh, duplicate that. I'm going to duplicate it twice. So here we have Instagram and here we have, let's say Facebook. Facebook, look like that. You're going to sit here Instagram. And how we can link them easy. You are going to click on any of these decks, click on the three dots, put the link, for example, on it. For example, www.twitter, uh, for example, dot com slash. You can go ahead and set the profile or the name of your Twitter. This is the first one. Uh, for Facebook, it is the same thing. And for Instagram, it is the same. So when you click on share, then you are going to download it. Make sure that you are going to download it as a PDF. So you are going to set these links clickable. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that you have enjoyed the content and I hope to see you soon on the next one.